All right, Coach. Season ended a little earlier than we had all hoped in a heartbreaking 81-80 to loss to Simpson here in overtime. Uh, in retrospect to the entire season, how do you think it all went in your first year here at Tessa? We had a fabulous year. Um, I really uh, was honored by the effort that the guys uh, gave us. You know, they had a very difficult situation with a, with a, a coaching change. We had uh, 40, 40 guys that were hoping to be on the varsity at the start of the year, and we had to make some very difficult decisions. Everybody handled it, uh, including the JV program and the varsity program, handled it uh, just terrific. You know, I can't say enough about our guys. Uh, and I give Simpson credit for uh, making shots down the stretch. You know, we had a really good lead. We made our free throws. Uh, they got, I mean, everything that they needed to do, every break that they needed to have down the stretch, they played and executed so well down the stretch that they made every one of those plays happen. Um, big time shots. And so I give credit for Simpson. I mean, I don't know if we lost the game as much as Simpson won. Coach, coming into this year, uh, you were very adamant that you did not want to make this a rebuilding year, having this being your last year in the Cal Pack and your first year here. Uh, how do you feel that the overall efforts went into not making it a rebuilding year and still putting a full effort in? Well, you know, I mean, you know, always get full effort, you know, and the rebuilding, you know, we, we did rebuild this year. You know, we, we, we played for the conference championship regular season in the last game of the regular season against Maritime, who's uh, playing, you know, right now to get ready to tip off. And uh, we had an amazing season. So, you know, we competed at the top of our conference, and we had a chance to go to the national tournament. Uh, they uh, did a terrific job of, um, uh, you know, finishing up and, and uh, like I said, winning, winning a tight game. You know, we had a big lead before the – big lead before uh, in the regulation. They had a bunch of threes to get it. We had a shot to win it at the end, and the ball just didn't – you know, we just – we turned it over. We didn't get a shot off. So, I mean, we did, we did everything that we could. Simpson deserves the credit for winning this game. It was one game, doesn't define the season. The season was terrific. Uh, winning record, 9-3 uh, at conference, and uh, we had an opportunity to win today. This is a fairly young team. You, on, you only have a few seniors that are leaving. Uh, how do you feel this plays to the future, having uh, such a strong team coming back? Well, we're going we're, we're, we're to keep building and, uh, you know, uh, get better brick by brick and, and trust in the process. Uh, I feel really uh, strongly about the core group of guys that will be returning. Uh, and I feel really strongly about uh, the guys that we'll be bringing in. Uh, and at the end of the day, I think that uh, uh, you know we're going to be a team to be reckoned with, and we're going to work hard every day to make sure that happens. All right, and lastly, Coach, uh, all year it's been preparations for this, the Cal Pack uh, Championship. Now it's over. Can we look forward to the future in the GSAC, and what are your thoughts on moving to the, the new conference? You know, we'll leave the GSAC talk for another day. Um, right now, we just want to really uh, reflect and honor the guys and the effort that they placed and give the honor to God. You know, we told the guys in the locker room tonight that uh, it was, uh, you know, an adverse situation and how they handled this is going to define them who they are as a man. You know, when you're successful, how you know how you handle that success defines you, and when you have a loss, how you handle that is going to define you. And we just talked about making sure that we never criticize a teammate and that we lift each other up and that we give all the honor to God, you know, with our actions, our words, and our thoughts. And so that's what we're working on right now. All right, thank you, Coach. The Warriors finished the season with a record of 15-12, their first overall winning record since the 09-10 season. Thank you, Coach.